Hey everybody, this is TJ Cates from Nashville Entertainment Weekly. We're in Nashville, Tennessee, y'all on Music Row, Historic Music Row, our website, NashvilleEntertainmentWeekly.com. I'm with... Hi everybody, this is Jill Santa Bonanza, and we're here with... Rosie O'Sullivan from the United Kingdom. I love United that. United Kingdom, that's exciting. You carry, came with Barry Tones, one of our good friends from the UK. That's right. He brought in Lily and P. Do you know Lily and P? Does I, everybody know everybody? I do know Lily okay. and P, yeah, she's a great mm. artist. Hey, Lillian. Yeah. Hey, Lillian. <laughs> we missed her this time, we understand she's in exams. Yeah, she is. She's at school and working hard. Now, you've yeah. been working hard here in Nashville. Uh-huh. We're going to come back to that. I want everybody to hear your amazing music. Can we break away, take it to stage and come back and talk? What are we going to play? I am going to play a cover called Tennessee Whiskey, which I know you know very well. Yeah. Right. Because we're in Tennessee. Which is mashed up with, because I'm actually a soul singer. So it's okay. mashed up with one of my favorite soul songs, Change Gonna Come, Sam Cooke. Very cool. And then I'm going to play another soul, soul jazz classic, Feeling Good, Nina Simone. Sweet. Nice. I love Nina yeah. Simone. Oh, wow. This is exciting, y'all. We'll be right back. This has been TJ Cates. Jill Sandovan. And on stage. Rosie O'Sullivan. Hi, guys. So I'm Rosie O'Sullivan and I'm from the United Kingdom and the first song I am going to sing is called Tennessee Whiskey which you all probably know quite well I've mashed it up with actually one of my favourite soul songs Sam Cooke, Change Gonna Come Uh, so I hope you enjoy it it's actually on my new album called The Nashville Sessions so if you're floating around and you want to grab a copy I've got plenty at the back
back what a what a great artist you are beautiful and you can play keyboard i can play keyboard and saxophone wow we're having Tenor one here or today. Alto, I love that. which kind of sax do we play i i originally start play started playing the alto but okay. i can play the tenor but i prefer the alto okay there you go yeah you want to know that that's sound. the only thing i know about saxophones and every time somebody mentions it i'll say that question because oh. it sounds like, like he knows about they're it they're all pretty much but there the, is a difference there is a difference so, so soprano it's more it's straight so it's just Correct. like a clarinet really yeah it's yeah i was gonna, gonna say a lot more so high pitch pitch but yeah. when you play can you sing do you go back and forth or do you just play you know that's what or that that would be a talent i would love I yeah. have thought about doing it. So there's mm. there's a song called um, what's it called? That's a really good question. There is a song it. I've always wanted to play. That's got a saxophone solo introduction. Really? And then it comes into that's what friends are for. It's got a sax introduction oh, wow. and then a vocal line. Mm -hmm. And I've always thought about the fact that's of a little soulful song too. I remember yeah. when it came out. That would yeah. be good for you. Mm -hmm. um, and I've always thought about doing it live. And then I, th I always think. Oh, am I going to run out of breath after the sex? I know. Yeah, it's, not a work the, it's like the running. It's like running a mile or I'd something, need, and then sing. Yeah, yeah. I need an extra pair of lungs, I think, backstage right. to bring on and <laughs> try <That's> again. <laughs> so, how long have you? How long have you worked with Barry? Um, I've worked for Barry with Barry for a couple of months now. I um, yeah. met him at a few festivals and gigs over in the UK. Mm -hmm. um, been lucky enough to uh, go on stage with people like Martha Reeves and Gabrielle. Um, and amazing. the three degrees, and he's always been there. Yeah, yeah. he's all over the place. Um, and I keep kept saw he, seeing him, and I mm. thought I need to get in touch with this guy, and and now I have. There you go, and so. things are taking off. Yeah, today. Let's talk about off. what you did today. Where were you at today? Um, we were at Ocean Way Studios, which nice. was pretty impressive. So for our music row. Yeah, Things music row. And mm -hmm. it was incredible. I mean, everywhere you go, yeah. uh, when the windows are down in the car, you just hear music everywhere, yeah. which is... Isn't it's, that neat? It's so cool. We love that about Nashville. Yeah, you can go anywhere and hear music. It's amazing. In Back in England, I mean, music's around, but mm. when you drive down a road in London, yeah. you don't hear music everywhere and not coming out speakers of a restaurant no. and yeah. especially live music it's all kind mm. of pre -re if you go to if you go out clubbing or pubbing right. in london it's all pre-recorded there's okay. not live music there on the stage that's the thing it's a lot of idea. artists when they come to nashville is they talk about oh my gosh i had no idea the talent that's out there yeah. that's playing mm. on the free stage and playing with a tip jar and these yeah. people should be the number one hit on, on music right now yeah. it's, so it's much a talent. lot to take in yeah but you're you came with a really good person and you're making great strides now where are you going to miami let's talk about let's so, talk about that my well, uncle willie yeah we're going to miami on friday nice um, we're flying out to see willie nelson that's just in two days everybody okay. she's gonna fly to now, miami willie's touring with ellison krauss yeah um is she with him yet have they teamed up yet i'm not sure i know that levon are supporting mm -hmm. i think Le i believe levon are from nashville uh -huh. are they i'm not sure maybe. i believe yeah. they are maybe well we're, we go um i know levon are supporting um willie nelson on friday so that's who the support act is so i'm not sure but i'm definitely we're we definitely see going Allison to see a lot at our little mexican awesome. restaurant yeah. We, so she pops into our Mexican restaurant. Oh. We see, we saw John Ridge. In we Nashville. see. It's a weird thing about it. Everywhere you go, yeah. We, we saw, yeah, Crystal Gale at mm, the Target yeah. oh, two wow. days ago. It's like everywhere so we are. There's so it's just yeah, it's you bump into people everywhere. You well, go everybody's got to go to Target. Everybody yeah. wants Mexican. Everyone wants some chips and salsa yeah. for the night. Definitely. So it's this is like the Hollywood for musicians. <laughs> everybody's here, yeah. mm -hmm. and people are going to bump into you, and they're going to because you look I like know. a star. You, you look, you look really great. She's dressed the part. 
just the, trying to dress the part. She is, mm, <laughs> definitely. And we're so excited that you played today on our stage and that you're here in Nashville. And so you have something coming up, or actually you have a CD that you've already released. Yeah, Let's talk about that. Released a CD called The Nashville Sessions. Just because mm-hmm. I was coming to Nashville, I thought, I was thinking about a title for the yeah. for the CD and I thought, I'm just gonna call it The Nashville Sessions. That's wonderful. Um, so that's um, the first CD is my own original material, which okay. is Soul and Motown. Um, and then the second CD, because I was coming to Nashville, I've tried to pick songs that help me make it through the night. is um, It's a country song by Chris Christopherson, mm-hmm. um, but Gladys Knight, who is my idol. You might see him around town too. Wow, really? All the time. All the time. Ooh, wow. He's a cool guy. He is a cool guy. TJ used to work for TMZ, so he would see everybody. Oh, I'll spot people in two seconds. Maybe yeah. one second. Mm-hmm. I'll have to go around town with you. And I know. Just, he sees the most everybody. Yeah. Like, he'll see somebody from like 100 yards away. He'll be like, oh, look, there's so and so, there's so and so. Well, oh. sometimes it's. He's not, really good at spotting people. Sometimes it's not okay to approach him and we give him their space and we don't yeah, bother him. Yeah. And sometimes, sometimes we'll say hi to him. And yeah. Crystal said hi to me before I said yeah, anything. Wow. We're looking Crystal for coffee it. together. So it's like, yeah, okay, it's okay. it was sweet. So, yeah. so that's exciting. Well, let's talk about who you're listening to because that's really interesting because you're in the UK. Yeah. So at the moment, the solo, I'm, I'm really curious about the solo Motown because I was raised on yeah. Motown. I saw Michael Jackson with the Jackson Five in oh, concert wow. in 1973, and I danced in the aisle. A little, <laughs> a little white boy that was five years old Incredible. was dancing. <laughs> Absolutely. I mean, Michael Jackson, Jackson Five, huge. Um, huge kind of idols of mine um mm. people like aretha franklin oh my gosh um, we we're talking about aretha franklin yesterday oh wow we yeah. didn't see her but i'd love to yeah he's um aretha franklin sam cook james brown um mm. so re- i was brought up on motown as well so in because mm. i'm a 90s baby i was born in the 90s mm. instead of listening to the uk it was Barbie Girl and the Spice Girls. You know about right. the Spice Girls, don't oh, you? We know yeah. All about the Spice yeah, Girls. they were they were my kind of era. Instead That's of fine. listening to them, I mm. was listening to Otis Redding and And Nina Simone. I love Nina, Nina Simone. Simone. Sitting on the dock of the bay, Otis Redding. Yeah. So yeah. Nina Simone, feeling good. Uh, Holy cow! Was That's my actually actually the first song I ever uh, learned to play on the piano. Um, and she so, plays the piano. Yeah, she's absolutely incredible. Mm. I love artists that tell a story with their voice. Oh yeah, um, so much feeling. She yeah. put. She mm. can make some sorrow hit your heart. Yeah, she really, really can. Fast. She can. I mean, and people like Gladys Knight. You listen to her, and she tells a story when she's singing. My Otis favorite Redding. song of all times is the first time ever I saw your face. Yeah, that's like the most amazing song, song to me. Roberta I'm, Flack. I can't even yeah, listen to it because it makes me kind of sad. Yeah, yeah, it's good, gorgeous song. So, what's um, your favorite song on your CD? My favourite song on my CD, on on the second disc, which is a covers disc, um, mm. I think my favourite song is actually Tennessee Whiskey. Really? Which is mashed up with Change Gonna Come. That's I do me. like Help Me Make It Through the Night. Yeah. Okay. And mind you, I like them all. There's, I've done a cover of Higher and Higher, Jackie Wilson as well, mm-hmm. um, which is pretty cool. Actually, I'm um, meeting up with Jackie Wilson's son. Um, so his son Sweet. has carried on his legacy, and mm-hmm. we're actually mil- meeting up with his management uh, tomorrow morning. That's wow, so fun! Because uh, Jackie Wilson's son's coming over to the UK mm-hmm. to do a few gigs and things. So fingers crossed, yeah, yeah fingers crossed. he'll um, we'll be able to collaborate. And Let's tell everybody where they can find you, find your music. Mm-hmm. Most important, buy your music. Yeah, so you can find me anywhere on social media, or if you just type Rosie O'Sullivan into Google. Is it Google over here? Yes. Isn't that Google, Google everywhere? It's yeah. yeah. Well, it's Google in the UK. I'm okay. not sure. So we yeah, if Google you just, over here too. Just type Rosie O'Sullivan mm. into your web browser, and it should all pop up. Okay, we're, we're, if you look above us, there's some links, and right below us, there's a website, mm-hmm. so you can find her, and um, just stay stay with us, and we'll help you find her, and more artists like you. You're really original, and you're really good. We're Thank excited to have yes. you. Thank you very Thanks much for, for taking time. Me. Thank you for being here, and we're so happy that Barry reached out to us with another amazing person. You guys have to check her out and buy her music. That's great. All right, y'all, this has been TJ Cage with Nashville Entertainment Weekly with... Jill Santamineza and... Rosie O'Sullivan. Bye, everybody.